Hello everyone, my name is Somongri and I'd like to welcome you guys to Sly Cooper Thieves in Time Demo. And this is the second demo that I will have shown on my channel and I'm very excited. This just got released today, so let's do this. And of course we want the full story. I should probably just start at the beginning. The name's Sly. Sly Cooper. And I'm a thief. From a long line of thieves. In fact, thieving is the family business. And business was good. Although, until recently, I considered myself retired. Having hung up my mask and cane, I was enjoying life on the other side of the law. In the company of a certain lovely Interpol agent named... Carmelita Fox. She and I had a history, which generally involved her trying to lock me up. So I should mention our current situation was only possible because she thought I had amnesia. I didn't. It was great to finally enjoy each other's company without a shock pistol being involved, and we quickly put the past behind us. But as time went on, the old itch came back, and I knew I needed to pull a heist. I should also mention that as a master thief, I only steal from other thieves. So it took me a while, but I finally found what I was looking for. My target was an upstart art mogul, a real hotshot collector. He seemed respectable, had even opened a new museum. But I could smell a rat. Reliable sources told me he was dealing in black market antiques worth millions. So I felt he should share the wealth. I was working on a plan when one night, as if on cue, Bentley showed up. Bentley was the brains of our operation, the mastermind. We grew up in the same orphanage where we bonded over stealing cookies, our very first heist. And we've been best friends and partners ever since. We hadn't seen each other for a while, but I knew immediately that something was up. Bentley had been enjoying his time off, too, building a new lab from scratch with his girlfriend and fellow tech whiz, Penelope. She had joined the team on our last caper, and the two of them had really hit it off. Apparently, they just finished work on a top-secret project when Penelope had simply vanished. Bentley was worried sick. He searched frantically, but found nothing. Then, he noticed something that completely stunned him. In his spare time, Bentley had been researching the Thievius Raccoonus, the Master Thieves Handbook passed down through the Cooper family for generations, its pages overflowing with the exploits and secret techniques of my esteemed ancestors. Only now, those pages weren't so full. In fact, they were disappearing right before Bentley's eyes. Realizing there was no time to waste, he gathered his gear and raced off to Paris. The first thing Bentley did was track down Murray, the third in our trio. Murray was our enforcer, the muscle, and the guy who'd eaten all the cookies we stole back in our orphanage days. Through the years, the three of us had become an unbeatable team, and we were more like a family now than a gang. Murray had been living his dream on the pro driving circuit, where his van had become famous, or rather infamous, for all the crashes he'd caused. Eventually, he was unable to find a sponsor due to his high insurance premiums, and he moved into Demolition Derby, where he remained undefeated. When Bentley showed up, however, Murray dropped everything to help out especially when Bentley explained that his van was the key to the whole plan. With Carmelita distracted by a new assignment, I took the opportunity to slip away and met up with the guys at our old Paris hideout. Bentley launched into one of his elaborate presentations and I saw the whole scary picture. Someone or something 
was literally erasing Cooper history. Then, to our amazement, Bentley revealed that he already had the solution, time travel. It turns out his top secret project was constructing a time machine. And now he modified the design to fit into Murray's van. We were going to travel back in time, stop those responsible, and fix the damage they'd done. Bentley explained the only catch was that in order to travel to a particular time, the machine required an object from that era. We knew from the changes to the Thievius Raccoonus that our first stop was feudal Japan. So here we were, about to steal a priceless 17th century samurai dagger from the same museum I'd been casing. Funny how things work out sometimes. That was awesome. I cannot wait for this full game to come out, and this demo is going to be great. So what do we have here? Looks like we have a little bit of Paris. Museum heist. And it looks like we upgraded the doors on the van too. Real nice. Okay, you both remember the plan, right? Of course! My mind is like a steel cap! Uh, that's trap, big guy. And everybody relax. We've been over it a million times. What could possibly go wrong? Famous last words. Look, we're only gonna get one shot at this, so we can't mess up. All right, no messing up allowed. Now stop worrying. This is gonna be a piece of cake. I'll see you both inside. Now let's get going. Sly Cooper, the thief. Alright, no messing up allowed. So let's break into this museum safe and sound. Alright, so we got a few pigeons. I'm liking these new I graphics. Why not take a couple coins? Well, we can. Fly. Don't forget you can double jump. Just jump, then press the X Bentley, the this isn't my first rodeo. Right. Just another one of my many talents. Alright. I think we're going this way. A museum heist? I've been waiting for this. This should be pretty good. Steal a famous painting or two and replace it with the duplicate. Always a classic plan. Don't know if that's our plan, but we will find out. If you find the need to adjust your perspective on things, you can move the camera around. Excellent. It's perfect for peeking around corners. Okay. I mean, that looks good to me. And here we got our goggles. Real cool. Change them up a little bit. I think I might have to invert the controls later on, but we'll just stick with it for now. All right, let's go. Press the circle button while jumping to interact with blue sparkling objects. I remember. That's how I pull off some of my best moves. Oh, the moon looks so beautiful. Just loving these enhanced PS3 graphics. Avoid those choppers, Sly. If they see you now, we're busted. Don't worry, they Bentley. Handle that. I got this. I'm a tightrope master. Hey Bentley, was truck surfing part of Murray's entrance strategy? Of course. Why do you ask? Uh, no reason. Anyway, it looks like he's in position now. Make sure you stay on these cables, Sly. You can't risk going down to street level right now. Not a problem, Bentley. A good thief prefers to stay above the action anyway. The Murray is awesome. Looks like the perfect night for a heist. Whoa! Ooh. All right, so press select to display the map. Let's check it out. Wow, they added a map. That's pretty cool. Let's check out status. Pretty cool. They show that we can pick up, looks like bottles, treasures, and another sort of 
part of a treasure, and then... I don't know what the Cooper symbols are, it must be something else. And the job is, I smell a rat, and the goal is to break into the museum. And I think those red parts are bogeys. And there's quite a bit of bogeys. So let's do this. Up and around, easy as pie. Hey, the Murray, how's it going down there, bruh? I think he's waiting for me. Alright, alright. No sprinting around the guards. Got it, Murray. I mean, Bentley. Sure feels good. Whoa, 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 whoa. Not the right plan there. Oh, we got zapped. Oh, wow. Alright, here we go. I just wanted an x-ray that last time. Just wanted to make sure that we were looking good from the inside, too. And we were, we were. Our bones look right and good as new. There's a lot of pigeons. So up we go. Look at the city. Just magnificent. Alright, where are we going from here? Looks like up. As soon as that light goes away. The old spotlights seem a little bit more deadly than before. Why, that flagpole looks like it leads right to the roof. See, I told you it would be a piece of cake. I'm a little out of practice. Do you say something, Sly? Uh, no. All good here, Bentley. Okay. It looks like you're going to have to find another way up. Use that ledge to move around to the front of the museum and stay out of that security light. I think I can handle that. Got it, Bentley. I can't believe the security of this place. This better be worth it. Alright, so we gotta be careful of the light here. And also, I noticed that Cooper no longer puts his cane in his mouth like he would before. What do we have in there? Huh. Alright, back up. Just as easy as before. Press L3 to display compass and current objective. Okay. Just like the old ones. This game feels real nice. It sure looks like somebody spent a fortune on this place. All right. I wonder what kind of surprises they have inside. Yeah, it should be interesting to see, Sly. I do agree. Careful now. That's the skyline we want, but it's locked. My instruments are showing that guard has a key. Don't worry, Bentley. This is going to be easy as pie. All right. Little pickpocket job. No big deal. Sly is the master at this. Move slowly until you're right behind him. When you're close enough, press the circle button to pick his pocket. You might have to... Got it, Bentley. Museum skylight key. To perform a stealth slam, sneak up behind an enemy and press the great slide. Zap. Now use the key to unlock the skylight. All right, let's do it. I'm in place. Let me know when you shut down the security system. Patience, Sly. You can't rush greatness, and I'm about to code a hacking masterpiece. Bentley, the brains. Interesting. The last time I was in these sewers, I was just a teenager. Good one, Bentley. <laughs> I love the reference. Man, this place is disgusting. Hey, that was just Splinter. Come on, Bentley. My bomb should make short work of that grate. 
I just need to press the triangle button. Now that was a blast. <laughs> I like his new arms with the bomb. Pretty slick. Check those out. That's cool. Alright. We can jetpack. Or not jetpack, but I guess wheelchair boost with our pack on the back. Let's do it. Who says turtles are okay. Oh, nice. It rewinds you in time. That's pretty sweet. Real cool. I like the effect. It's over here. There's more money. And it looks like hacking is back. Wasn't a huge fan of hacking in the last couple, two and three, so I'm hoping to see more variety in this one, and I've heard it could be pretty fun. So let's bomb this thing. I like the little grenade it has for a symbol there. Nice. Just everything is just so crisp and smooth. That's a big jump. I better use the hover pack here. If I jump and press and hold He's still talking through the depth. All right. My jets will let me glide a long way. Ooh. I see. What? Thank you, technology. And thank you, Bentley, for being so awesome and so smart and so right, green. That platform is blocked. I'll have to throw a bomb to clear it off. If I press and hold the L1 button, I can bring up my range finder. Then I can adjust the range of my throw by pressing forward or backward on the left stick. Once I find the right distance, I just press the triangle button to toss a bomb with pinpoint accuracy. That's a direct hit. Just like that, Bentley. Booyah. If I fall in that filthy water, I'm buying a new shell. You can buy new shells these days? Man, the cost on that actually is pretty expensive. But it's not like we're a broke turtle or anything. Back here, anything? Ooh, one of those Cooper symbols. Nice, we got one. So they must be hidden all over the place. I wonder what those will do for us in the real game. I wonder if we miss one with Sly now. Probably. Why didn't I wear my rubber gloves? That noise. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Is that a bad guy? That's a bad guy. Alright, let's take him out. Is he going to be on this other side? I like how there's trash cans down here. Wait a second. Hold on. Move back here quick. Just want to see if we can take him out. Nope. That's solid steel right there. Alright. Let's move forward here. Hmm, according to the schematics, the control room is right underneath me. All I have to do is find a way in. Some explosive, and voila! Instant shortcut! Phew! Talk about your close shaves! How's that security system coming, Bentley? Uh, great! Perfect! I'll be done in a jiffy! That was a close call. Press select to display the map. Alright. Well, looks pretty straightforward. Looks like we're going up and left. And the status, we got one of the Cooper symbols. Cool. Alright, let's go. I love the new hover wheelchair animation. That's pretty awesome. Next time, I'm giving Sly the sewer job. Pickpocket him. And... This is a little gift. Now for a patented Bentley hack attack. What do we have over here? It looks like some sort of missile. What do we got over here? The same missile. Hmm. Alright. Let's do this. Let's get our hack on. the main docking gate before the security code flushes us from the system. The left stick should navigate the ship. Alright, so we got a little turtle this time. I like it. Very cool. The right stick should control the bit cannon. The bit cannon can blast right through that firewall. Bit cannon performing well. Moving while firing is key to cracking this system. Alright, so kind of similar. A little bit upgraded graphics, I would say. 
Get this. Yes, a data key. And we're good. Dang it, this reinforced firewall is too strong for the big cannon. If I use that upgrade slot, I can engage my Panzer code. Oh yeah, time to bring out the big guns, baby. Gigabomb. Gigabomb shells will crush those firewalls. Oh yeah, that's pretty cool. You can upgrade your hacking equipment inside the system. Be like a real hacker. Security drones. I can either dodge them or blast them. All right, we're gonna bomb them. We're gonna get the key here. I need to use my shell code to get the data key. I better switch back. All right, we gotta switch back here quick. Grab the key, and then we're golden. All right. I can use this data key to disable that firewall. What's this one do? Wait, that's what we just were. Perfect. Hack complete. Oh yeah. And that's the way the code base crumbles. Okay, Murray, you're up. The Murray is always on, Bentley! The Murray! The Brawn. Okay, Murray. We need to get you back in fighting shape. Why don't you warm up with a few basic attacks? Press the square button to punch. Where did you get that piece of broccoli? The old muscle memory is really kicking in. And the cupcake? Press and hold the triangle. Nice. All right, let's own these guys. Yes. Can withstand a pink tornado. That's pretty awesome. To perform a thunder flop, jump, then press the triangle nice. while in the air. Oh, thunder flop. How oh, I miss you. Oh, man. You clowns don't know this is to awesome. The Murray is a beast. And he is just straight knock him up until they can't take any more. Oh wow, we had different options here? Alright, we're gonna have to pick up another guy here with the stomp in a second. Come here, bro. What you got, brah? Let me just stomp you up here. What do we have? Slam, shake, let's shake him. You punks better call for backup. My knuckles are just getting warmed up. Oh yeah. Alright. So, more guys. And let's shake this guy. Wait, come here. Or not. These guys don't do anything. Their guns, they just bounce off the Murray. You guys should have taken the night off. Look at all these coins. Getting rich. Whoa, what's over here? Just another dude. Come here. Shake. Come on, give me that money. Give me that money. Just like sucks into my pocket. And the air toss. No problem. Oh yeah. These guys are nothing. They're like little mice. I wonder if they're like pinky in the brain trying to take over the world. Where did you come from, shortstop? I think we have a rodent problem. You chunks are no challenge. Come on, Demarie, you got this. Okay, cool. So it looks like there's a lot, a lot of stuff to do with even DeMurray. Right, I got one of two 
So I gotta break something else here. This looks like to be it. Okay, Sly. The security system is down. You're all clear. Great. I'm going in. I love how Sly is just hanging out up there. So let's steal this sword. <laughs> What the? You didn't really think you were gonna get away with it, did you, Ringtail? Carmelita, the girlfriend. Ex-girlfriend. <laughs> hey, Carmelita! Oh, funny meeting you here. Sly Cooper, you no good lying thief! I'm locking you up for good! Sorry, gotta take a rain check. I'll call you. Cooper! Good evening, this is Sly Cooper. I'd like to request a ride. You, Sly! Now quit messing around and get down here! We're in the van and ready to roll! Au revoir. Let's hit it! Buckle up, boys! Oh yeah! Just like in a demolition derby! Whoa! I'm controlling this. Whoa, where are we going? Where am I going? Where are you going? Just setting up for the jump. Welcome to Air Murray. Thanks for flying. Nice landing, Murray. Hey, Bentley, not to complain, but we're kind of trapped here. Relax, Sly. Just put the dagger in the receptacle. Perfect. Isotopic decay calibrated. Adjusting fusion synthesis. Anytime you want to punch it, Murray. Punch it. Let's do this. You got it, chum. You got slow down, Murray. I never do. Whoa! Sly Cooper, thieves in time. 88 miles an hour of goodness right there. Aw, oh, yeah. Well, what else can I say about Carmelita? As you can see, our relationship is complicated and I just succeeded in upgrading it to hazardous I certainly wasn't expecting her to crash the party she'd been so busy with her latest case I never thought she'd have her eye on me in fact I would kind of been counting on it but then I should have known better than to underestimate inspector Carmelita Fox as much as she liked having fun Carmelita was serious about her police work and now, I had a lot of explaining to do. But the plan was in motion, and there was no stopping now. Even though I was thinking I'd need the time machine just to patch things up with Carmelita. Before the heist, we'd recruited our disco-loving, scuba-diving friend, Dimitri Listo, to look after the Thievius Raccoonus. Because it was irreplaceable and the only guide we had, it was far too risky to take the book through time with us. Bentley had even invented a communication device to allow us to contact Dimitri no matter where or when we traveled. It was a perfect situation, since it allowed him to update us on any changes to the book while limiting our exposure to his fashion critiques. Everything was happening so fast. The past few days were just a blur. But as we howled through the time vortex, I realized we were in for a very long trip. Oh yeah, well I hope you guys enjoyed that demo. Do not forget to hit subscribe. We will be doing a full playthrough of Sly Cooper Thieves in Time. And remember to thumbs up if you enjoyed this demo. Have a great day everyone.